Hi guys! So it is induction day, um, and I'm not scheduled for induction till this evening, but this morning I was leaking more what looked like fluid than discharge, so we're actually going to go get some breakfast real quick, um, and run to the store real fast, and then we're going to go up to the hospital to see what that was but we have all of our bags in the car and our pillows and yeah so I will let you guys know and keep you updated I'm really excited so we are now arriving to the hospital um to because I told you this morning about how I was leaking a bit and so we just got done eating breakfast, and now we're gonna go in here and see what they say. I also had a little bit of um, blood, kind of, when I went pee at the restaurant. So I'm gonna let them know about that. And I've also been having some contractions that are feeling pretty tight, somewhat painful. So we shall see what they say. So we are in the maternity welcome center here at the hospital and they said they're probably not sending me home. They're going to take me up to labor and delivery soon. Yay! So we are in my labor and delivery room and I'm in my lovely gown. And they have me hooked up to a... Uh, what's it called? Pitocin. Pitocin. And we are just walking the hallways now to get some things rolling. And oh, and there's Yuri, and uh, yeah, so we're going to keep walking, and I will update you guys more later. <clears throat> okay, so I forgot to mention that um, they checked me before they started the Pitocin, and I am 3 centimeters dilated, 80% effaced. They started my Pitocin off at 1, okay. and... Do you know what time it is? It is, uh, yeah, it's 3 30. It's 3.30 right now in the afternoon on Wednesday the 19th. 19th? Yes, Wednesday 18th. the 18th. 18th. Are you sure? Mine says, oh, you know what? Mine just might, I might not have refreshed. 19th. 19th. Oh, it is the 19th. <laughs> it's the 18th. And, uh, yeah, so I'm gonna keep walking. And, um, I will keep you guys updated. Hi. Very strong contractions. Deep breaths in. And get what time it is, too. <laughs> So they, I don't even know where to start, it's crazy. Um, I was having really strong contractions for only about half of an hour or so to where I was being very vocal, pretty much yelling, and then I said I needed to have the epidural, so I got the epidural and they just checked me not that long after getting it and I'm already 10 centimeters, which is crazy because they didn't start the Pitocin until like yeah. two or three hours ago and I'm already at 10 so I'm actually gonna start practice pushing here in a bit so crazy so excited so yeah um, the next little clip will be Nora probably unless I decide to videotape me pushing which I probably won't <laughs> so yeah yay can we get the bed up a little bit yep. Do you want her feet adjusted at all? Her feet are fine, okay. but we'll need the light adjusted. Okay. All the way down there. Okay. Mm. It's like all the way over. You're so precious. 
Is that any better? Or is it still That's no, it's perfect. It's good. Okay. I'm so glad that you're out of me. There you go. Yeah, now dig those feet in this. Oh, you okay. got it. Okay. Let me grab your new gown. Hold on. Your hat. She's looking at me. She's looking at me. Do you see her again? I mean, oh my gosh, she's so cute. You are a warm bundle. Now you know why I was hot all the time. Oh gosh. Oh, she's so alert. I'm recording, by the way. Oh. Nora. Nora. Hey guys, I'll be back. Okay. Good job. You did awesome. Thanks. Hi. Hi guys. So... It is now almost 3 o'clock in the morning on Thursday, and I don't even remember, was Tanya videotaping when I was, like, I think she videotaped after she came out. Well, I'm still going to be doing a labor and delivery video probably a week from now, but I just wanted to let you guys know, thank you so much for all your thoughts and prayers, and I did have a really fast labor and delivery. I cannot even believe that that happened. It's so surreal. She is just the cutest thing ever, so. You can put the little things so you can see. And you can tell how much she weighed and stuff. Nora was seven pounds, one ounces, and she was twenty inches. Mm -hmm. And her head it was twelve inches in diameter. She a little feet. And she's got some big tiny feet. <laughs> So, yeah, I am so excited to finally have her out, and I am going to try really hard to rest tonight, but I'm not sure if that's going to happen, just because I'm very excited. I'm also starving, <laughs> and I'm in lots of pain, but watch for my labor and delivery story. I will see you guys in my next video. Bye.